I am Anil Kumar. In this video, we will learn how to simplify and evaluate expressions with multi layers of fractions. We have x over x minus 1 divided by x minus 2 minus 2 over x minus 1 divided by 1 plus 3 over x minus 1. So we will begin by from the denominator, the lowest most part. That should help, right? So we have x over x minus 1. Let's keep it like that for the time being. And here we have x minus 2 minus, so we have 2 over x minus 1 divided by, divided by 3, uh, 1 plus 3 over x minus 1. So we can take x minus 1 as a common denominator. So 1 gets multiplied by x minus 1, right? So we could write this as, as, or let me rewrite this as 1 over, I mean, x minus 1 over, so we'll take x minus 1 as a common denominator. So we get x minus 1 common denominator and 3 here, correct? So at this stage, we have simplified that part, right? So we have simplified this part. Taking common denominator of x minus 1 gives us x minus 1 times x minus 1 plus 3, right? Now, from here, we can move x over x minus 1 divided by, we have x minus 2 minus 2 over x minus 1 divided by x minus 1 plus 3 is x plus 2. So we have x plus 2 over x minus 1. Now, this could be written as a product of x minus 1 over x plus 2. So, we'll rewrite. We have x over x minus 1 divided by x minus 2 minus 2 over x minus 1 times x minus 1 over x plus 2, right? Now, we have x over x minus 1. We can simplify this x minus 1, x minus 1 cancels, right? So we can take x, by, x plus 2 as a common denominator. Let me take x plus 2 as common denominator. So we get x minus 2 times x plus 2. So we get x minus 2 times x plus 2 minus 2, right? So we have x over x minus 1 divided by, this is difference times sum, so it is difference of squares, x squared minus 4 minus 2 divided by x plus 2, right? Now we could write this as x over x minus 1 times, that comes in the numerator, x plus 2, minus 4 minus 2 is 6, so I could write this as x squared minus 6. So that is the expression which we get when we simplify all this, right? So that is our answer. So we can write down our answer as x times x plus 2 divided by x minus 1 times x squared minus 6, right? So that is how we could actually simplify the given expression. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.